<coughs> Whoa! You may not think I'm pretty, but don't judge on what you see. I'll eat myself if you can find a smarter hat than me. You might belong in Gryffindor, where dwell the brave at heart. That daring nerve and chivalry set Gryffindors apart. You might belong in Hufflepuff, where they are just and loyal. Those patient Hufflepuffs are true and unafraid of toil. Oh, yet in wise old Ravenclaw, if you're a ready mind, where those of wit and learning will always find their kind. Or perhaps in Slytherin, you'll make your real friends. Those cunning folks use any means to achieve their ends. So put me on, don't be afraid, and don't get in a flap. You're in safe hands, though I have none, for I'm the thinking cap! <laughs> Bravo! Brilliant! When I call your name, you will put on the hat and sit on the stool to be sorted. Neville Longbottom? Hmm. <laughs> Gryffindor! Hermione Granger? <laughs> well, <laughs> Gryffindor! Draco Malfoy? Slytherin! Ronald Weasley? Gryffindor! Harry Potter? <laughs> difficult, very difficult. Plenty of courage, I see. And not a bad mind, either. Eh? There's talent, oh my goodness, yes. And a nice thirst to prove yourself. Now, that's interesting. So, where shall I put you? Not Slytherin. Please, not Slytherin. Not Slytherin, eh? Por que no las dos? Are you sure? You could be great, you know. It's all here in your head. And Slytherin will help you on the way to greatness. No doubt about that. No? Well, if you're sure, better be Gryffindor!